Hi, Claire Staines at Law Florian Dog Services. I do a lot at puppy class and with all my clients discussing using daily portions of your food and interactive toys. Often we just put the whole shebang inside a bowl. For me, that's a, a waste of valuable resources. So we all start with a comb. So I will put a portion of the daily meal inside a comb. It takes longer for the dog to get out, it's mentally stimulating, it exercises the jaws, really good and really effective for puppies as well because we can use this a lot in training if we want to teach a puppy to lie still somewhere on a mat for a while or go to their bed or into their crate, all those sort of things. So Kongs are really, really good, really effective. So simplest way to use your Kong. I don't use the Kong stuffing, sorry Kong. I prefer to make my own. So I'll start off with a, a simple Kong um, that uses, as I've already said, portions of the food. So we take the Kong, we have it, you know, shaped like this, little hole this side, big hole this side. Pop it upside down in a cup, okay? Then what we're going to do is we're going to take a portion of the dog's daily meal, which my dogs are kibble fed, and we have just moved to a lovely new brand of food from Donna and Nando at In The Dog House. So this is their green free range. So you're just gonna pop them, the kibble inside there. And you want to fill it so that it's just, sort of just under three quarters full, okay? So the kibble's in, been popped in there. Then what we do, excuse me, is we take a kettle that's just boiled obviously with water inside it, and you pour that right through the big hole at the top. And just pour slowly till it covers all the kibble. And then all you're gonna do is wait. Because what we're gonna wait for is the hot water to make all that kibble expand up so that it starts to stick to the sides of the comb. So we'll just leave that for a couple of minutes I'll get back to you in a wee second once it's done. Okay, so that's been left for just over five minutes. Um, so it's nice and soft on the inside. I've removed the Kong and drained the excess water out so that, you know, it's dry now. So we'll pop that back inside the cup. Now, the next step that I do is I take some Pramilla cheese and this is just purely to create a plug at the top. So we just put some of that Pramilla in. Now the Kong has almost come to the top now so that's that done and it's all filled. So it's just covered the hole at the top so it's created a plug. Now what we're going to do is we're going to take this Kong and we are going to pop it in the freezer for, for around about an hour and then all the kibble that's stuck to the side will freeze. The cheese at the top will freeze also. So we'll just Pop it in there and then it's ready to come out and just give directly to your dog. Great way to get your daily dose of food in there and also a good way of your dog enjoying chewing. So there you go. Thanks for watching. Happy training.